What is up, YouTube? Ads here, and today I have an advanced warfare commentary. And uh, the gameplay in the background before I get started is some classic kill confirmed on. Uh, I cannot remember this map. Biolab. That's right. I turned off all the XOs, so it uh, it plays more like the the older Call of Duty's. I just prefer it. Um, I can't deal with the XOs anymore. <laughs> um, what I wanted to talk about was that. Uh, Esports and uh, the MLG, and this year with Advanced Warfare, uh, over the past weekend, um, the EGL Open was on in Blackpool in the in the UK, and uh, I managed to watch a lot of it, and I only really saw two guns being used the whole event, and uh, that was the ASM one and the BAL, and uh, why would you want to use anything else really? The the, the most uh, overpowered or probably the best uh, guns in the whole game easily um, they're probably the top two guns in the whole game and uh, every that's why every team used one uh, sometimes they'd have uh, looked like they had overkill on so they'd have the, a the bell and then the ASM one as a secondary and uh, you might get the occasional sniper but that's very very occasional uh, it was just so boring to watch and uh, I just found it quite bland and boring uh, this this Call of Duty might have might have been the uh, the worst Call of Duty to watch for, as an eSports watcher or uh, a fan of competitive Call of Duty it was just there was no gun variety there was no gun balance which meant to uh, less variety in game and and watching uh, it was it's been that way for a while, playing as well and uh, skill based mat skill based matchmaking. Sorry, uh, it didn't really help that issue. Uh, people just wanted to sweat twenty four seven, and uh, what what better way to sweat than uh, use the the two best guns in the game? And uh, that's why now, as you see with this gameplay, I'm playing bots. I just can't be bothered dealing with it. And uh, yeah, it's just. It's quite boring, and uh, I'm looking forward to Black Ops 3. Uh, I think it's going to be much, much better this year to watch as an esports. Uh, the gun balance is there already with the beta. Playing the beta, uh, you could see there's a variety of guns being used, and uh, hopefully that uh, comes through in the esports too, because uh, Black Ops 2 had a lot of variety with the guns. Uh, it wasn't just two guns being used by every team, and uh, wasn't boring to watch. It was actually actually really really good to watch. Um, but uh, that's pretty much it. That's all I wanted to talk about. And uh, looking forward to Black Ops Three. And uh, let me know what you guys think. Uh, do you even watch esports? And if you do, did you find this year's Call of Duty uh, not that fun to watch uh, and pretty bland? Anyway, if you like the video, please hit that like button. Subscribe. And uh, also in the, the link in the description uh, will be for my Twitter if you want to follow me on Twitter and uh, keep up to date with uh, when I'm uploading and what I'm doing with the channel. And I'll catch you in the next one. Bye guys.